what's up you guys so right now i am about to go to the gym with my dad hold on gotta unlock my car um so yeah that's what's happening right now and i believe it's like 7 15 7 15 ish so yeah i have another doctor's appointment that i gotta go to at 11 40 um my first appointment, I didn't really want to talk about it on, you know, on here and tell you guys about it yet because I didn't know for sure what was going on with me. But basically, I was diagnosed with anxiety and depression, and they put me on this medicine called Prozac. And so I pretty much just have a follow up with that. And um, yeah, so you guys are going to come with me to this doctor's appointment. And that's, that's the plans for right now and for the day. So, I will talk to you guys later. Okay, you guys. So, I am back from the gym. And um, now I'm about to take a shower. And I'm going to be getting ready to go to my doctor's appointment. Um, I know last time I went, I told you guys how, like, I used to be, or how I'm scared to step on the scale, and so I think today I'm going to step on the scale, well, like, you know, look at it, because every time I go to the doctors, I always get on the scale backwards, and so this time I think I'm gonna just look at the number, and I'm gonna try to, you know, be calm about it, because every time, like, I go, I just... I don't know I get really nervous and I don't like it I always just step on it backwards it's just a I don't know but yeah so I'm gonna try to do that today and I'm gonna get Starbucks today and after that I really don't know I don't really have anything planned after that and also I'm sorry that I look like crap I know I said in my last vlog that I was gonna start you know looking better to feel better but today I'm just not feeling it and I just really just want to rest today because I've been so tired lately and I just I just want to sleep you guys I just want to sleep and so yeah so I don't really have anything big planned today but I'm about to go take a shower and then um, I'm gonna go to my doctor's appointment and I'm gonna get Starbucks and then I don't know I don't know double check I don't know we'll see after that all right bye so I started um, keeping up with what I do now and having a calendar is a lot more easier you know so yeah this is a new thing I'm, I gotta scratch this so I already did all this I went to the gym went to the gym today and I gotta go tomorrow so yeah then I'm just gonna walk on the weekend but yeah having a calendar to keep up with like um, to keep track is a lot easier okay so I took a shower and I feel better and now I'm just waiting to go to my doctor's appointment, which is at 11.40. And right now it is, I think, 10, 10.05. I don't have my glasses, so I can't see. But, um, yeah, it's 10.05. My mom's going with me. I feel like, you guys, I wore this shirt last time I went to the doctor's. I think I did. I did. But that's okay. This is just my doctor appointment attire, I guess. So it's just my high old high school shirt with uh, some army shorts. Because I don't really plan on doing anything special today. Like I told you guys that. Like today is just, you know, my first day off work. So I just kind of want to chill today. Tomorrow though, tomorrow I don't know. Tomorrow I might, you know, dress up or something. But I'm not sure. But, um, I'm really nervous, you guys, about going to the doctors. Like, I don't know why, but I always get nervous. Like, it's just the scale. Just think about the scale. Like, if they have to weigh me, I get so panicky. Like, my anxiety's up. Like, I took my Prozac this morning, and I haven't taken it in, I think, two or three days. So, today was my first day back being on it, in which that's why I'm going to the doctor for, um a follow-up to see if it's helping me or not and it does calm me down like at first it wasn't working but now like you know it does calm me down a lot and so I, I think it's working but I took it because you know my anxiety was up right when I woke up 
about going to the doctor and it's still up a little bit but not as bad but I don't know we'll just see what happens when I get there so we'll see well I forgot to share with you guys today but a couple days ago I had the most like happiest moment happen to me like um there's this girl on my Facebook page and she posted a picture of how much weight she lost and you know I commented and I was like you know I almost didn't even notice you like you look great keep up the good work and you know what she said to me she was like thanks um I pretty much just I watch she watches my YouTube channel and she follows me on my Instagram page my weight loss one and I'm pretty much her inspiration and that made me feel so good about myself and it also made me realize you know, because at the time I was slacking with my weight loss journey, but it made me realize that people are actually, you know, looking up to me, watching me and, you know, taking some of my tips. And that makes me happy. Like, and that makes me feel like I'm not doing this YouTube channel for nothing and I'm not making an Instagram page for nothing. And so that just makes me happy. Anyways, like I was saying, I pretty much do this YouTube channel and I make my Instagram weight loss page for anybody you know to help people out and help myself because I want to get healthy and I want people that want to be healthy to get healthy and you know why not just you know share my knowledge on what I know about weight loss and all that and what I'm learning so I appreciate you if you watch my channel if you're subscribed to my channel or if you're following me on Instagram or any social media and just watching sorry trying to get good lighting just watching my you know my weight loss journey at all i appreciate you a lot and thank you for watching and i hope that um you're taking my tips and i hope they're working and yeah because i'm not a professional i'm not nothing like i'm just you know i'm a regular person trying to lose weight and trying to be healthy and fit and you know I'm just educating myself and sharing what I know and what I learned that's all I'm doing I'm not sponsored to anything at all like I'm just you know a little brown girl trying to lose weight that's all I am and so I appreciate you if you're watching my channel and my, you're following me on anything the lighting sucks oh my god but thank you thank you and it makes me happy and it honestly like pushes me to you know do better like when I am slacking and I hear stuff like that like people are looking up to me or I'm, I'm their inspiration it makes me want to do better because I have people looking up to me and you know so I really do appreciate you guys Starbucks Yay. and when I went to the doctor's office today I looked at the scale you guys yes I'm so proud of myself I finally did it but I'm not, I wasn't happy with the number like I still weigh the same 
so that needs to change but I looked at the scale and um yeah oh, this is so good but um I'm gonna end the vlog here oh if you guys are wondering why this is here it's for motivation like I want to be in this in a couple weeks so <laughs> that's why that's there but um I'm gonna end the vlog right here because I'm really not gonna be doing anything for the rest of the day but just chilling and you know just chilling so um thank you for watching my you know vlog for today um and I will talk to you guys next time make sure you like comment and subscribe and thank you for watching bye my account say you sick and like the Titanic David Blaine last summer man you had to vanish I get it